Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, it is time now since we finished the Ford uh, Canopy Cab to start a new project. And what I have in mind, as you can see here, we got a, a Dodge pick -em up truck sitting here. But I want to make another Dodge Mini Pumper. Since the one I had, I sold and kind of regret that but then again that's why you buy models so you can you can build more and i'm, I'm going to start with the 78 dodge pickup truck kit but we're not going to make a 78 as you can see here in this picture our grill is much different and i just so happen to have one here. This grill was for a 74 or 75 Dodge. And that's what we have here. No, no turn signal up here by the headlight. And it is, for the most part, a perfect fit. So we will be able to create either a 74 or a 75 mini pumper. And again, back to our reference picture, the uh, wheels and tires on this guy, we actually have some of those. And we have the dualies for the back. Now these, uh, these wheels and tires came out of an old uh, monogram uh, Ford uh, dually pickup truck that I've had sitting around for eons and just never used them. So I'm going to use them. But one of the things we have to do is obviously, you know, start, start on the cab and... I'm going to wind up cutting the frame for the Dodge just back behind the cab. And then I'm going to use the frame from the Ford Dually on the rear of it so that I can get uh, all the rear end components in there the way they're supposed to be. And we will scratch build the two of them together. We'll make them up. And then another, another little mini episode that we will have during the build of this is I'm going to walk you guys through how to uh, take one of these uh, twin sonic light bars that are not really a twin sonic and how to go about uh, fixing all the internals on it. To, to actually make it look like a twin Sonic. We'll have a separate video on removing all this and making the guts for it because I, I really dig the clear domes. And as you can see, these don't like to snap in place very well because they, they just pop right back up. And they're just a little ill-fitting. So we will correct all that in this process. And we will go on from there. I just got done watching an absolutely fantastic video from Louie over at the Autistic Modeler. If any of you guys aren't subscribed to his channel, uh, I would highly recommend you do because he builds some absolutely great models. And he and I have been talking on Messenger for the last few days. And come to find out, he's been hiding all his great uh, emergency model builds from all his viewership. And so I told him, I was like, Louie, you, you need to make a video of all those. So I just got done watching it. He just posted it. He's really a good modeler. And uh, I'm going to have to step my game up so he don't steal all my viewership. But Louie, great job on that. Again, it's... Uh, the Autistic Modeler. So go over there, give him a, a like, a subscribe. 
He's he's been here recently building kits for round two. I've been watching those. They have been appearing in their uh, Facebook ads for all the new models coming out. So he's really doing a great job with that. So again, go go check Louie out over at the Autistic Modeler. You'll be pleasantly surprised. He's a he does some great detail work. He he's a guy after my own heart. I mean, he's a he's a rattle campaigner and he does a damn good job of it. And he's got a great hobby room too. So go go over there, check him out, watch some of his videos, give him a like, a subscribe, and uh give him a thumbs up. But back to this uh monstrosity over here but that's what we're going to be doing for the next couple weeks or so we're going to be taking the uh, mpc dodge 78 dodge and trying to transform it into a 74 mini pumper and with that being said guys thanks for watching thanks for all the great comments on uh, the ford canopy i really appreciate it and she's already found her place, a, a new home over there in the cabinet. I think what I do it. Yeah, she's up there, up there with two other Fords. So she's found her new home and it's time to get started. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.